Hello, royal enthusiasts, and welcome back to our channel. Today, we have heartbreaking news from England concerning two of the most senior members of the royal family. King Charles and Princess Catherine are facing critical health crises, sparking deep concerns about their ability to continue their royal duties. As the British monarchy grapples with this troubling situation, fans of the royal family are left wondering how this will impact the future of the royal household. Before we dive in, don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. Reports have surfaced suggesting that King Charles, who has been battling cancer, is not doing as well as the public has been led to believe. Despite positive spins about his return to royal duties, it's becoming increasingly clear that the 75-year-old monarch is struggling. Recent photographs show a visibly frail King Charles, who appears to have lost significant weight and aged considerably in the past year. Royal insiders are worried about the toll this pack schedule is taking on his health, especially with an upcoming tour of Australia in October, which may hinder his chances of a full recovery. Camilla, the Queen Consort, is reportedly deeply concerned about the King's well-being. While she understands the importance of his royal duties, it's been said that she's been urging him to slow down. She's particularly alarmed by his decision to maintain such a grueling workload, which includes flying from Balmoral to Southport and then to London within just a few days, despite his declining health. Close friends of the Queen have revealed that Camilla has been advising the King to take a break, but Charles is known to be a workaholic and refuses to heed these warnings. One alarming moment occurred when King Charles participated in a traditional Balmoral welcoming ceremony, only to fly hundreds of miles the next day for an intense visit to Southport, a town shaken by the tragic murder of three young children. The king attended a private meeting with the bereaved families in London the following day before returning to Balmoral, raising further concerns about his insistence on carrying out such emotionally and physically taxing duties despite his ongoing cancer treatment. While some palace insiders support the king's determination to continue working, others are urging caution, fearing it may worsen his condition. Adding to this somber news is the revelation that Princess Catherine, the Princess of Wales, is also dealing with a health crisis. Her condition, while not as publicly discussed, has deeply affected the royal family, leaving two of the most prominent members of the monarchy sidelined. This situation has placed immense pressure on Prince William, who is now stepping up to shoulder more responsibilities within the royal family. Sources indicate that the Prince of Wales is seriously considering taking on a more prominent role to support both his father and the monarchy during these challenging times. In light of King Charles's health battle, there are growing whispers within royal circles about the future of the British monarchy. Some insiders suggest that King Charles may have already given his blessing for Prince William to prepare for a more immediate transition to kingship. This potential shift in power dynamics comes as a shock to many, as a more gradual change was expected. However, with the king's health in decline, William may be stepping into a leadership role sooner than anticipated, marking a significant moment in the history of the British monarchy. As if these developments weren't enough, reports have surfaced that during an urgent meeting at Balmoral Castle, a decision has been made to strip Prince Harry of his remaining royal titles. This bombshell decision, reportedly finalized while Harry and Meghan were on a trip to Colombia, signals a turning point for the monarchy. The implications of this decision remain to be seen, but it marks a decisive moment as the royal family navigates its way through this tumultuous time. 